Pacific Beach, San Diego, Southern California. You can see why it's now the number one destination for J1s. It's also become home to one of the best sevens competitions in the GEA world. And with new camera angles, a new venue, live streaming, teams from right across the states, superb action across all four codes, and enthusiastic celebrations, the West Coast Sevens has returned after COVID in style. Oh, it was great to be back. Players have been itching to play again. The, the pandemic was hard on everybody and it was just, it was wonderful to be back in, in action. We were really surprised we, when, we, when we said we were gonna do it, we had no idea how many clubs we'd have. It was a bit of faith, you know, not knowing, not knowing what was gonna happen with the pandemic, not knowing the cost of the flights, the cost of the hotel, everything went up. And so it was a, it's a tribute to everybody who got together and came, but yeah, we were thrilled to have as many clubs back as we were. We had 36 uh, back this year and it was a fantastic. A tribute to everybody. Let's pay tribute to the people actually who helped you out here. Oh, absolutely. I, I have to give a shout out to Volunteer for Chelly. They've been with us all this, uh, basically since the beginning. We've been, as I said, eight years now, and uh, they're a, a organization, um, a gay and lesbian organization that work to build the bridge between uh, other organizations and, they, and their volunteerism. And, fantastic organization. In, a, in addition to that, our new facility here at uh, Oh goodness, uh, Southwestern College. Um, the faculty have been am amazing to deal with, and so that that's really helped to put the games on and help bring it back. And, and having that, um, in addition to that, our committee is was phenomenal again. Um, even with, with the COVID, we were short some staff and we had some hiccups uh, along the way. But I don't think anybody really noticed. Everybody that I've talked to seems to be very very thrilled with the event and saying it was very well organized. And that's a tribute to everybody. Everybody really pulls their weight and, and does it. And Jerome, I have to thank you guys. Your dream team has made a phenomenal thing. I had Lisa come to me and say, oh my God, it was so special. My mom was on, she got to watch me um, with the anthems in the background and what a special treat that was. And so I, I personally cannot thank you and your team for as much work that you have done. It, it helps showcase. I even had somebody text me and say, we needed to water the grass. You know, so people are watching and, and Jerome, you know, that day I reached out to you many moons ago and you came, you guys have been fantastic. So um, I know I've left out a few people, but um, I think that's that's good. Uh, we've we, a lot of people here in, in a, a great a great event. Thank you. I know there's a lot of people watching this and they're thinking, that looks amazing. Look at this behind us, like the color, the sunshine, San Diego, great football as well. You want more people to apply to come next year and I'm sure you'd love teams from Ireland or anywhere else in the world to come over here and it's so doable, it's sevens. I mean, you need 10 players. Absolutely. In San Diego, we had a little struggle with the field sizes, and so we, we went with the sevens and found that that really works well with our, our structure. We'd love to have teams come. I know we talked to um, a Japan team about possibly even meeting in Hawaii and playing some games, but we'd love to have as many clubs come. We, we have all kinds of um, skill level and in, in the grades. We try to, to be as inclusive as all to everybody and everybody have a great time. But yeah, everybody's welcome out here. Um, they were talking, the, the uh, staff here were talking about taking this next year to a three-day event I'm not sure we can all handle that but we'll, we'll do what we can but we uh, we want we want people to come out and enjoy San Diego it's the finest city in America here's a plan for you finally Nafina here in San Diego that's your club Nafina in Dublin our cameraman's from there so I'm going to get him to bring 10 lads out Abu Dhabi Nafina come out here Coal Island Nafina and Tron let's have a Nafina getting together here. Maybe out for our 10th anniversary, that'd be fantastic. Nafina has, is uh, the the uh, most senior club as, or as far as tenure goes in San Diego. And uh, we'd love to have a Nafina reunion with all the clubs from all the different uh, countries and, and everybody. That'd be fantastic. Can't believe it's your eighth year and that's probably going 10 years because of COVID. Like, but I'm sure some people thought this would only last a year or two, but it's, it's still here and it's bigger and better than ever. Yeah, it, it, every, you know, we have stages in my, it, at times where I okay, can't do this again. And then you get to the end and I can't do it, can't not do it again. People just love it. Um, it's, it's, it's amazing to be a part of it and to the love of the game and the people are so appreciative. Um, just, I just love it. And everybody pulls together, cleaning up. They tell me, oh, don't worry about that, I'll do. We had no trouble from anybody. It was just, it was a, uh, a wonderful weekend.